Night on the cusp of two first alert weather days, of course, Tuesday and a Wednesday. Let's take a look at our impact potential. And again, what we've got for you is this rain changing to snow and a wintry mix creating slushy icy travel conditions. And again, what we're looking at is just rain overnight tonight. That changeover will occur at separate times tomorrow, depending on where you're located. The farther north, the farther west you are, you're going to see that snow earlier and that shift will move east throughout the day. Several inches of snow potentially in northeast North Dakota, uh, even a few pockets of measurable snow in Minnesota. Minnesota. We'll cover that in just one second. Blowing snow from strong winds could create tr slick travel. That's as we get toward Tuesday night and Wednesday. Low visibility at times as well. Now what we have here is moisture potential. This is rain. This is snow kind of just that potential moisture overall. This is through Thursday morning 8 a.m. So what we've got for you is this. All the areas here shaded in yellow. You can see a little bit of orange. That's about one to two inches of rain slash snow combined. Now that doesn't include just the snow accumulation itself. So again, let's talk about this. Let's look at it We're going through midnight tonight. You can see so much of the yellow orange here indicating that moderate to heavier rain as well as some of that dark green area. Notice it just kind of hanging out tomorrow morning. 5 a.m. Here we go. We start to see just a little bit of a mix there. Now 9 a.m. Tomorrow morning. Notice this area of blue exploding here. Temperature still above the freezing mark, but this is where we expect to see snow start to come down. So it's not going to necessarily accumulate right away. But eventually that will be the case as our temperatures go down. Fargo could see a little bit of snow around midday. We will get a break in some areas, including Fargo, I think during mid to late afternoon. And then the circulation around this low brings snow back down into the region. Notice now our temperatures are below freezing. So tomorrow evening, Tuesday night, Wednesday morning, notice the snow just sticking around here in the valley as well as much of uh, not only western Minnesota, but of course northeast North Dakota as well. So that's that snow starting to add up, starting to build. So again, accumulating snow generally going to happen later tomorrow afternoon, evening through Wednesday mid afternoon through evening. The most snow is going to come northeast North Dakota, but I think valley locations do have a chance of picking up uh, some decent snow totals. So two o'clock tomorrow afternoon. Notice snow total still very, very limited, very low. Watch it fill in 8 p.m. tomorrow evening. Then once we jump to 8 a.m. Wednesday morning, morning right through about midday afternoon. Then we're looking at pockets of again six plus in some areas. Others about one to four inches. So through Wednesday two inches or more. You see the area shaded in blue and brown. That is at least over half the areas have a chance of seeing two plus inches. Once you get to the four plus notice those uh, numbers, those areas of blue, they, they start to shrink a little bit. We're looking at 40 50%. So again, two inches pretty likely in most areas four inches again other than Northeast North Dakota, maybe a little bit in some of the valley locations. That's about it. Satellite and radar for you. Take a look at our wind gust forecast taking you through tomorrow morning, tomorrow afternoon. Wind gust 30 to 45 miles per hour. So we're talking about snow coming down, snow blowing around late Tuesday into Wednesday, creating very poor visibility. Roads will become a little slick in some areas as well. Right now it's rain in Fargo 44. Cloudy conditions, Grand Forks rain is knocking on at your door. Next couple of days, we're going to see our high temperatures tonight. Temperatures uh, cooling down throughout the day tomorrow. You see dry, tomorrow afternoon snow pretty much across the board late in the day. Wednesday snow showers. We're going to see highs only in the mid to lower 30s. Quick look at our 11 day. 31 Thursday, 28 Friday, a few chances of light snow here and there next week, but the big story is going to be all of a sudden we're down to 28 Tuesday, 24 Wednesday, Thanksgiving Day, hey, 21, and then 20 next to Friday. Yeah, that nine is not looking great. <laughs> <I> mean, <laughs> it's just the beginning. Mm, thanks, thanks, Russ. Russ. Yeah. <laughs>